<laughs> so, my thoughts on a gun share program, I wouldn't be a for it. It would be, I mean, I'm all for bike share. I do that here. It's great. It brings the community together. It's a great way to save money and also navigate the city really well. As for gun share, I mean, I get the idea. You want to save money, but having guns this accessible and really easy to the public and also like in a very crowded area, I think could cause a lot of chaos and a lot of issues. And um, I don't know, I wouldn't like it. And it really make me uneasy walking around here knowing that if I piss someone off, instead of road rage or getting an argument, someone can just walk over here and try to sell an argument or a discussion with an assault rifle right in broad daylight rather than with how we usually do it, which is, you know, try to get to a resolution. So, yeah, I wouldn't be for it. That's it. I think uh, that it would be very dangerous to be able to rent guns like it would be easy to turn the bike. I, I, I think that for our society, uh, it's, it's a big no-no. It would be good. In person, and actually see what it would be like in the setting that they would propose if they were to go that route. And it really makes you think about it, rather than just talk about it, really think about what it would be like if this was out in public, would you bring your kids out here? Could you walk out here? Would you, I mean, like mental health or other things? Or would it also be just like anybody can access it? Would you require ID or anything? I don't know. And so for that, I think it's better not to have it. But I can't, I don't know if I speak for the whole public. So that's just my own opinion. Huh? I don't know. But I have tried it. It is fun. And I just want to say that if it were as easy to get a college education as it was to get these assault weapons, everyone in this country would have a college education. And I'd rather see people have a college education than one of these weapons of mass destruction.